What do you really need from an air compressor for an airbrush system? I'm Warwick from Harder and Steenbeck and these are our need to know basics. Now there's a lot of heavily featured air compressors out there with lots and lots of features and lots and lots of performance. But really the most important thing in our view is the airbrush itself. If you had to choose between biasing more of your budget towards the air compressor or towards the airbrush, bear in mind the piece that you have the creative relationship with is the airbrush. So get the airbrush right and then just make sure that your air compressor is sufficient. What is sufficient? So first of all, I think it's good that it's fairly quiet because that enables you to think when you're working. And it also means that if you're working from home, it's not going to bother anybody else. I think it's also useful to be sure that your air compressor can be used for longer periods of time. You want to be able to sit down and airbrush for an hour or two without worrying about whether or not your compressor can handle that. So I think that's a feature worth looking for. Typically, you'll get that from a compressor that's automatic. They can generally run for longer than those which are not. The other feature that you really do want to have on your air compressor is that the air is smooth and pulse free. Uh, when you have air coming up to the airbrush that is pulsating, it makes it quite difficult to really control what your airbrush is doing. The final feature that I think is really important is you need to have air pressure control on your air compressor. That means you can govern how fast your airbrush is going to spray. You can put your airbrush in the right window for giving whatever kind of performance you need for the work that you're trying to do at that time. You'll typically get that either from a bleed valve system or most commonly nowadays, you should look for a compressor that has an air pressure regulator. So in summary, the ability to control your air pressure, pulse free airflow, relatively quiet, and automatic. If you've got those features on your air compressor, chances are you really don't need too much else to put you in a good space to get the most out of whatever airbrush it is that you're using. I hope that helps and see you on our next video.